Greetings everyone, Kaius here. I uh, want to just make an update for the channel and because a uh, new video is going to be coming out uh, sometime uh, next week. I'm working on it as of this moment, but just wanted to give you some, a little bit of a explanation for what was it called, the terminology I'm going to be using for my videos. Uh, so, what's it called? Like, with history, it, it is a little bit interlinked with politics as the, what's it called, Meiji Restoration kind of shows. And, like, you know, where it's like a very, well, kind of political, it can be like that. And I, and then, um, inevitably, I think with, uh, what's it called, with my plans, I'm going to be having to use political terms. So, I'm going to tell you what political terms I'm going to be using and explain why. Personally, I won't be using, trying not to use uh, the terms like left or right, or whatever, like those type, left, right wing, authoritarian, and libertarian type stuff, or whatever, unless the movements call themselves that, because the terms to me are imprecise and don't tell you what movement really believes and all that, and just, just kind of... Plus, like, from what I've seen, whatever, the term literally just comes from where people sat at and during the French Revolution and the Council. Like, the left wing were, like, the Republicans, the people who wanted a total end of monarchy, rule of the people, blah, blah, blah. And then, the, then at the right side, there was the monarchist who believed that the, the crown could do no wrong and such. But, yeah, I... And I just don't think, like, a term like that, like, repul like uh, where, because in modern terms, left wing is a lot different than just a bunch of French Republicans uh, of the time. Like, like the people who wanted, like, re Republican in the term, they wanted a republic, not the political party. So I, th I just personally think that that in right wing is not even really doesn't really even refer to like monarchists much anymore, from my knowledge. Like right wing usually refers to either like a weird variety group, but like most people, from my knowledge, at least people use it to refer to supposed to refer to fa fascist type groups, which uh, I I don't, I don't I'll just say yeah, like I just believe like you know the term the term you know the two terms are just out way too outdated and they should just not be shouldn't really be used it's like i'm i'm not gonna blame anybody for using them that and there's like so much confusion what left wing and right wing truly means and because because of a bunch of discourse about whether or not like this group was left wing or not this group was right wing or not it's like a bunch of bull and all that like it, it really uh because, like, I don't definitely think political ideologies are a lot more complex than the, what's it called? What the traditional, what's it called? The traditional graph ideology puts it at, where they're, where the ideology is like a, what's it called? I'm trying to remember it's the name of it. It's like the political compass. I think it's a lot more complex than that. And my, because they, you can't really quantify, like, a, ideologies just on an axis like that. I would say there at least needs to be what's it called a at least a third axis. Was that like just a, and all that? But you know, uh, I don't know. Yeah, I know people are probably going to disagree with this, but I'm just going to explain why. I'm going to use the term. I'm going to explain, try to explain the movement in detail, and let the, you guys decide whether it should be one of those terms. To me. It, the, the terms don't really matter too much because left and right wing and all that like especially in American politics or whatever like the terms are so convoluted and messy that they could mean a, both terms can mean a variety of way too variety bigger variety of groups that have not much in common but per but I guess, I guess people but again I like believe what you want. I I don't I oh I don't really mind. Like just don't don't be a piece of garbage in the comments. Okay. Like I don't 
be respectful. I'm not trying to make any political statements. I'm just saying my, just telling you guys why, uh, what's it called? I'm not going to be using the terms. I'm going to be using more accurate and then maybe explain like the ideals of the groups and let you guys decide whether they, which group they are, just which type of wing or whatever they are. But eh, I, I, know, I know this is just, I know I probably sound, don't sound very, like, like I, I know, I don't know if I sound smart or not, or, like, if I sound smart, or just sound like some type of, like, like, dumb centrist. I'm not trying to sound like that. Or that. I'm not saying the political ideologies are, like, totally alike. I just think in the, the groups that are grouped together have, don't have enough in common, like, with the wings, or whatever, the two wings. I don't think they have enough in common. To true, like, like to be like, anything, any type of group, actual group, but eh, that's just my piece. Like, tell me, tell me what you, tell me what you think in the comments or whatever, and I'll be seeing you in the next episode coming out uh, this coming Monday, which is the about the war. Hopefully, the war in Arabia. See, see you guys then. Adios.